All right, guys, welcome to, I believe, me and Throne's first matchup of Madden 22. It is an absolutely amazing game. I actually pulled these highlights of this game from my stream at twitch.tv slash kmac. I'll link both my Twitch channel and Throne's YouTube channel below, just for whatever reason, if you don't know Throne, which you probably should. He's the best content creator out right now, an awesome player as well. And like I said, this game is absolutely worth watching. Comes down to the final play of the game. And again, this was pulled from my stream. So if you guys are wondering a few things, one, why I keep looking down to my right, I am reading my Twitch chat. You guys probably see like someone subscribed or someone hosted my stream in the top left as well. The other thing is there's a giant donation goal in the bottom right corner. Uh, that's not something we typically always have there. It's kind of just a troll. If you guys watch like e-girl streams on Twitch, they always have a donation goal. It's like a uh, new bathing suit, $200, new PC, $2,000, or a uh, new Ferrari. Because I mean, who knows how much money they're raking in, like $200,000 goal. We have our own donation goal. Um, if you guys want to help me contribute to that donation goal, make sure you guys hit the subscribe button here on YouTube, man. And the one last thing I wanted to quickly note, if I like mumble or if I'm kind of quiet, I apologize. I can't really mess with the audio levels of just my voice like I can when I'm recording exclusively for YouTube. So I apologize in advance when I record for YouTube. I obviously like present to the camera. I project my voice very well. Whereas like when I stream, it's more like casual laid back. So I apologize for that in advance. It's really not a big deal though. It's in my opinion, it's perfectly fine. It's a great game as well. Super excited, man. Let's jump into it. Oh, we're playing Throne? <laughs> Throne lurking or is he recording for, for the tube? I gotta make that tackle. Oh, Big hit, baby. Yes, sir. Seymour, go get him, baby. Oh, I went for the strip. Oh, my God. I went for the strip, bro. What am I doing? Should have just went for the hit stick. Try to go for the strip. I feel like the strip is like a really good way to get it out though. Like I feel like even if you hit stick them clean, it doesn't always come out. Oh, he's a touchdown. He didn't see it. Oh, he's got a touchdown anyway. Okay, well, I didn't think that was open. The streak was butt naked. It looked like the crosser was covered. We had like seven people there. Apparently not the case. Dude, Derrick Henry is just a menace. Impossible to stop. All right, Lynch, let's relax, buddy. Just get out of bounds, Lynch. Just get out of bounds, dude. We can't trust you with the ball in your hands. You're a liability. I mean, grow up, dude. Darren Waller. Spin move. All right, maybe I should sit in the spawn. Still a nice dot. Russ, on the money. Look at Renfro. Look at Renfro. Outdated, but he still has a lot of heart, baby. He's scrappy. He's sneaky athletic. Way to click off. I mean, I, that's what I'm saying, dude. Like, have some pride. Have some integrity. Wheel route. Darren Waller. Ooh, baby, that's a laser. Do we go for two? Do we chase points early? I don't trust myself, man. I don't trust myself. I'm kicking my extra point. I might be a pussy. Who knows? What, what other lines do they have at the uh, the draft or the combine that they say about dudes? It's specifically white dudes. Sneaky Athletic is like the most popular one, right? Yeah, first <laughs> first guy in the building, last one out. You can catch him pumping uh, air into the, in the team's bus, tires at halftime. Yeah, exactly. Look at the special teams coverage. I mean, outstanding. McMillan, I'm so proud of you. He's a team first. Yeah, he's a team first guy. Great learner. God, no! Sean T, we gotta jump a little higher. Maybe I gotta use her Hendrix, dude. Do I need to use her Hendrix for the rest of this game? We need more height out here. We need more height. Ooh, we're screaming right there, coach. Go get him. Go get him. Who was that? Was that Tatum? Tatum's another guy with a whole lot of heart. Again, you can't measure it. Oh my god, we got smoked off the press. Are you serious? 
Oh, Percy Harvin is just moving off the line like that? <sighs> Man. That's Simmons, too. Simmons is usually pretty good for me on the press. He just got absolutely torched right there. Cordell. Okay, okay. Oh, don't let him get off the ground that quickly, man. Come on. We could have used him as like a blocker. We got around the corner. No, 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 no. It was a touchdown. Oh, my God. What a fucking catch. Oh, my God. Oh, my Lord. Cliff Branch. Come on, man. I saw it. I saw it too late, dude. I don't even know how he got open. It was just a normal streak. I think he just ran man. I think he just ran cover one. I guess what happened since I had the post and the streak, I think they ran into each other. So his guy just like got bumped off coverage and just left him wide open. But the problem was I was already rolling all the way to the right. And I'm not passing up that opportunity. I'm not passing that up. I actually, I actually cannot believe I caught that. That is the first time I've seen that animation, I think, all year, especially with a small receiver like that. Yep, here it comes. Here it comes. Here comes the bomb right back. A lot of people are, I think a lot of people are doing this thing where they like double team the end so they can just let the contain come in free and then they just outrun him because contains are like just so busted. We gotta run him down right here, boys. Oh, man. Bro, Derrick Henry is a problem. Ah, I tried to bait it and go back up. I just came down way too hard. Oh, wait, what? That wasn't a touchdown? I mean, that's just perfect defense. It's perfect defense. That's all I can say about that one. Ooh, we're right there with Simmons, baby. We're right there. Oh, come on. I hate escape artists, bro. They got to take this out the game. That was such good defense, too. I was trying to click on, just, uh... I got clicked on too late. <laughs> okay. Well, we're down two possessions now. That's unfortunate. Cordell and Cordell crime right there. Oh, what a throw from Russ. That's why Slinger's so good. Oh, Lord. That was almost a wild throw. Super Aaron right there. A high ball action. Yes, sir. Oh, come on. They ruined my perfect game right there. That was a dot, too. Maybe I just uh, moved a little bit too far back. I feel like I had to, though, to avoid the contains. Oh, we got to stay in bounds right there, Waller. <laughs> what a lead, dude. I mean, he's six foot two. I feel like we just have to. Dude, dive from like four yards out. Look like Jordan out there. <laughs> God, make the tackle. There you go. Might have left him too much time, boys. 22 seconds with one timeout. I might pull a Bills right here and just give up points somehow.
This is what the Bills should have done, though. They should have sky kicked at the fullback, dude. Shave off, like, two or three seconds. That can make a huge difference. Unless he spin moves and goes up to the 32, 33. Pulling bounce, too. We gotta jump that. We might get points right there. All right, pretty decent half. I mean, we get ball. We're down three. I mean, we've been going just back and forth. This is a good offensive game. The only problem is we just haven't got our two point conversions, and he has. I gotta run a bit more with Russ. I think I'm trying to like actually cook up a route combo instead of just pressing a button and taking off. We score here though. Obviously, uh, we take the lead. That sounds like a Booger, uh, Booger McFarlane quote. Waller, I'm racking it. I'm racking it. Waller with the spin move, the slowest spin of all time. Maybe I should have like, I don't know. I don't know what I could have done there. I don't know if there was a better ball carry move. Maybe I could have trucked him, but I think that's Harrison Smith. Or uh, actually that's Taylor Mays. I don't think that would have even worked. Escape artists, is, it's just, <laughs> they gotta take it out the game, dude. They gotta take it out the game. Look how good it is. It's insane. Although I will say, like, after watching Patrick Mahomes and Josh Allen, it might be realistic. I'm always terrified of like contains picking passes off because it does happen. It's happened quite a few times. It happens like honestly way too frequently. Now, when I say that, it happens like once every three or four games maybe, but it, it really does happen. Oh, I had X. Okay. I had X. Oh, I had it. I had it. I had it. I gotta make that read. Ross, I didn't really get all my hot routes off. I was doing, uh, I was doing audibles in bunch because I was planning on audible in a bunch, but I didn't want to take a timeout, especially not this late in the game. And I didn't want to take a delay game to make it an even more difficult conversion. So I was like, you know what? I'm putting the tight end wheel out here. Hopefully he doesn't man it up. He has to run to it with his user and I'm just taking off with Russ. It worked, but the problem is we got to stop. Something we haven't been able to do yet. Not even close either. Oh, I have two zones right next to each other. Oh. Ah, come on. Seymour, we're gonna get contact right there, maybe? Oh, those are crazy adjustments, too. I gotta just, gotta come down my user. There we go, Seymour. Oh, that's a pick. No! The cross man, the linebacker with acro. We got an enemy right there, dude. Seymour is going crazy right now. Let's go, kid. Yeah. 
Oh, we gotta land that hit stick. It like literally would not let me click on it anyone and then it just wouldn't let me run over there. Oh GG's. Damn it bro, we needed that pick. And Taylor Mays went right through our hands. Bummer. I got kind of like cooked right there, I can't lie. GG's.